Okie dokie. Today I'm going to show you guys how to go from a three quarter inch ball valve or a three quarter inch pipe or coupling or whatever. Three quarter inch PEX to a half inch PEX. I'm going to show you guys how to do that today. Now I got this part at Lowe's, okay, in store. This is a shark bite, three quarter inch to one half inch, okay? This is a PEX reducing elbow. Now they have a reducing uh, coupling as well where it's just straight instead of an elbow. But this is what I'm using, okay? The exact thing that I'm using from Lowe's. Now I'm gonna show you guys the tools that I'm using. I'm gonna be using this right here, the E-filled cutters. Now this is from Plumbing Cell. Plumbing Cell sent me this and you guys can check out the Plumbing Cell website and the link in the description below. Find out, uh, they have all kinds of stuff. They actually sent me the pipe. They sent me the rings that we're gonna be using. You've seen this stuff before. Um, trusted companies, also this one right here. I crimp, these are the crimpers that I'm gonna be using if you want the exact crimpers that I'm gonna be using. This is from I crimp. I'll leave this website in the d description below as well. These crimpers are pretty awesome because they cut the rings, these little rings right here for plumbing, they cut them as well as they crimp them. It has two settings, okay? Two different settings. So this is a very cool tool as well and I'll be tossing my old ones. So stick around, see how these tools work. The first things first, as you can see down here, um, there's nothing here. So we have to connect the pipe onto here. I'm gonna be uh, using the elbow going this way and then connecting to this top copper piece right here. So I'm gonna set you guys down and show you guys what I'm doing first. I'm actually gonna be taking this piece of pipe right here and cutting a small piece off. So let me set you down. What I'm doing is taking this out of the package, the fitting. Now that this fitting is out, I'm taking a little short of three quarter inch because this is the three quarter inch ball valve. So make sure this is straight, which this is straight because that plumbing cell cutters works awesome. So now this can fit on there and we wanna make sure that we have a piece that is long enough to fit this portion and then the piece down there. So we're actually gonna need a little bit longer than what's here. So how are we gonna measure that? I'm gonna do it like this, okay? And so this one will end right here and then we'll do it a second time. So it'll be right about right here. So I'm gonna cut this pipe about right here. Make it a little bit longer. Okay, here's how easy this cuts. You can see it has that little digging, it digs in right here. Line it up perfectly because these are sharp. Now watch this. Ease. Now I'm gonna take that little piece right here and what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take two rings Okay, I have two rings. This piece right here, we're gonna do this. A plumbing cell ring right here on this end, a plumbing cell ring here on this end, and we're gonna line those up where we want those just like that, okay? You're gonna wanna crimp them in, not right on the ends, but inwards a little bit like this, just like I have it, and make sure they're straight. Okay, so this is what this is gonna look like. That's all that is, and it's gonna go on there. But before I put that down there, we can actually make this a little bit easier on ourselves and put this one right here. Okay. Now here is the eye crimp tool. So that's how that opens like this. And you're gonna be crimping on like I said, make sure it's straight. Double check everything. And we want it to go just like this. Okay. Okay, squeeze it tight and then it opens up. Okay, now we'll get the other one lined up. Okay, it's gonna go about like that. And we're gonna put it down there now. So let me set you, let me come over here. This is gonna go right here. Ah, 
accidentally push the it's hard with this camera I'm gonna have to move you guys over here okay that's where that's gonna go Okay. The tool works great. My hands are a little bit wet, and a three-quarter inch those rings, you gotta you gotta push them pretty hard. That's to be expected. My other tool, these are actually a little bit easier than my other tool, and this is a tight space. So anyway, we have one ring here, and we have one ring here. We have the shut off here. So now we're linking from this three-quarter through the shut off to another three quarter. Now this could be a coupling or whatever. Okay, we're just crimping the rings from this three quarter. Now we have this fitting going to a half inch now. Okay, so this is half inch. And we're, you wanna let, you wanna straighten it all out. Okay, so that's straight now. Now I'm gonna pause you guys and go get some half inch pipe, also from Plumbing Cell, so let me go grab that really fast. Here's the half inch PEX from Plumbing Cell, and this is the tool inside the box, the E-field that they sent me, okay? Now, I'm gonna take a piece of that and get a measuring tape and cut the exact lengths of the pieces that I need and all that, okay? I'll be doing a red and a, and a blue, but in this video, I'll just be doing the blue, so we'll start with that. I'll get that cut. I'll see you guys here in mean, about five minutes after I have all the pieces cut and prepared and all the, uh, all the things set aside.
I'm gonna take you guys in close now, show you guys what's going on. So here's what's going on. The water comes in right here. You can see behind me, this is where the water kicks in. Okay, it's insulated, but that's a blue PEX pipe. It's insulated coming in. That's why I cut the floor out. It runs over here, okay? It kicks up right here to a shut off. Okay, now we need to run it from here. We went from three quarter to a half inch right here. We crimped, 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 crimped. Links in the description below for these websites. I crimp and um, plumbing cell, okay? We went around, round, round. There's a 90 back there. We crimped, crimped. I put all these pieces together and measured everything and put it together out here. And then I just crimped this, okay? All this was already put together, okay? We did this right here, boom, boom. And once I crimped this, all this was, so I didn't have to crawl back in the cabinet. That's what I'm saying. I did it all right here, right in front of your guys' eyes. All right, now you can see this is a little bit too long. That's okay. I'll snip this right here. This is the right height. And or see, it's it can go down a little bit or up a little bit. So we'll go down to right there. So it's the right height. Now I'll cut it to the right length. And you guys can follow me over to that next video where I crimp it in right here to the copper.